Hi, Dr. Goldberg here, continuing our infectious disease series. Um, today we're going to talk about gram-negative aerobic uh, diplococci and gram-negative aerobic cacobacilli. A couple bacteria that are important to know about. First, we'll look at the gram-negative diplococci. There's basically five organisms in this area that you need to know about clinically. Number one, Neisseria gonorrhea, obviously the big cause of an STD. Urethritis, cervicitis, PID, uh, very uh, sensitive to, to uh, rocephin, a uh, third generation cephalosporin, as well as azithromycin and uh, other oral antibiotics. It's an intracellular pathogen and uh, very potent. Um, so, need to know about it. Neisseria meningitidis is its cousin, uh, the cause of human meningitis, uh, excuse me, adult meningitis. Uh, not inhibited by uh, complement very well, especially in some patients. Causes acute meningitis and meningococcemia uh, and septic shock. So need to be aware of Neisseria meningitidis. Meroxella cateralis, which used to be called Neisseria cateralis, then Brahmella cateralis, now it's Meroxella cateralis, is also a gram-negative diplococci. Uh, causes... Uh, Communicular pneumonia causes uh, other URIs, retitis media, sinusitis, uh, always beta-lactamase producing. Kingella causes endocarditis and septic arthritis, especially in children. Uh, know about Kingella. And lastly, Acinetobacter, which is a uh, uh, organism that causes nosocomial infection. Our gram-negative uh, cacobacilli are basically just three uh, areas. Uh, Haemophilus influenza is the most popular. That causes, of course, epiglottitis and community-acquired pneumonia and sinusitis. It has antiphagocytic uh, properties in its capsule, and it also produces endotoxin, uh, easily treatable with extended penicillins or third generation, or second and third generation cephalosporins. Bordetella, uh, which causes pertussis, is also a gram-negative cacobacillus, produces four different exotoxins and an endotoxin. And then lastly, Legionella, which causes Pontiac fever and, of course, the lethal Legionnaire's disease. This is an intracellular pathogen that uh, is uh, one of our, our top causes of atypical pneumonia, uh, sensitive to respiratory fluoroquinolones, macrolides, and the tetracyclines. So know about these uh, interesting aerobic gram-negative uh, species. Uh, signing off for now, Dr. Goldberg.